identity as indigenous people. I am a plaintiff in Black Horse, I was a plaintiff in Black Horse versus Pro Football, and now am being sued by the team in Pro Football versus Black Horse et al. There are four other uh, petitioners in our case. We are all younger Native American people. A lot of people say the, the opposition Native American people say, you don't represent us as Native Americans. We support the team. That's only a very small portion of our population. What we do represent is the large majority of Native Americans who are offended, who have been damaged by Native American mascots. And there is an overwhelming majority of Native Americans who are opposed to mascots. And this issue is not a new issue. It's been going on for over 40 years. In 1992, Suzanne Harjo filed Harjo versus Pro Football, along with other Native leaders, including Dr. Manley Begay and the late Vine Deloria Jr. In that case, they won. And it was overturned on a technicality stating that they waited too long to file their case, stating that they should have filed when the first registrations came out in the 60s and when they became adults. So in our case, we are a younger generation and we filed immediately after we turned 18. We won our case in June. It's a huge victory for Native American people all over the United States into Canada and into Mexico. Right now we are being sued, but I am very, very confident that we are going to win in this case. Thank you for your support. Thank you for your support. I'm so happy to see so many natives here. You guys are so beautiful. Our culture is so beautiful. This is who we are. We can say what our identity is. We make that choice, not a football team. A football team is not our culture. That is their culture. It is their culture of racism that they promote. And they are making millions and millions, if not billions of dollars off of us. We don't want their money. We will not accept their money. You guys know that there are some 
students who are bused in from Red Mesa, Red Mesa High School. And their logo and their mascot is the R word. We do not agree with that. It must change. And from what I'm hearing in that community, a name change is going to happen soon. It will happen sooner. So we want to let our children know who are being used today. We want to let them know that we are here for them. We are not going to disparage them. We're not going to yell at them. We're not going to say bad things to them. We're going to support them because they don't know any better. The adults in that school should know better. And they are not informed of this issue. And shame on them for that. So we will let our children know today that we support them and we are here for them. There are also other uh, other native organizations and other native um, tribal leaders who are rumored to be here. I think the Zunia Pueblo Council, who I hear is not officially a council person, is also here as well. So we will let them know, let them know that we do not agree with them. We do not sell out over here. We will not accept money from the team. We are not sellouts. And they need to understand that. It sounds like they don't have that awareness. They don't have the education that we have. And we need to let them know that. We're not here to fight amongst ourselves. We're not here to, to but call them bad names or anything like that. We're here to let people know and raise awareness. We're doing this in the most respectful way with dignity, honor, and respect, because that's, that's what we do as Native people. And so, just to let you know, you will be yelled at, you will be called horrible names. This is kind of a, you know, a danger, it can be a dangerous situation, because these fans, when they're drinking, and they are get riled up, it can, it's a potentially dangerous situation. I want you to know that, but we have security here. We have some people here who are wearing um, security, uh, and out of respect for the indigenous people of this land, we ask the traditional O'odham Council to say a prayer for us, because that's what we do as Native people. We make sure that we say our prayers, not just for ourselves, but for everyone here, for the safety of everyone. And so I want to welcome David Garcia. Going to say a prayer. Other people in this community who have not woken up and realized that racism is over, that, that that time is over, that we're here as indigenous people and we can celebrate. We need to move beyond uh, structural violence, colonialism, the assaults against, you know, when we talk about violence in our communities, and we look at the, the, the serious health impacts that we face, uh, we look at the root of that as colonization, we look at the root of that as racism. We look at the root of that also is capitalism, because this is a, not only a war against the people, but it's a war against Mother Earth. And so we're here not only just for, for the change of the name, because we know not it's not going to end there. We're here for justice, for respect, and for dignity, right? Yeah. Um, and so I'll turn that back over to Amanda. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, so thank you, Flea. We're going to... Um, be Change your mascot. Change your name. 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 Change the mascot! 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 Change
Foundation and the Washington team. Shame on you. I want to invite them here so that we can share this information with them. They need to be here because this is this is Native America here. Their mascot and their symbol, those aren't Native Americans. That's their Indian that they think it's okay to make money off of. They are making billions and billions of dollars off of our backs. Right. Our culture is not a mascot. Our culture is not a word called Redskins. We don't call each other Redskins in our communities, right? Yeah. We don't call each other that. We say Native American, Indigenous, even Indian, Navajo, Hopi, Pueblo. We don't use our word in our communities. So I want to thank you again for being here, and let's continue to spread awareness on this issue. A name change is going to happen. Just watch. Yeah. I don't like it. 
Those who have done my job, they can be known as fans of my house to help you build us skate park. And you can put that on all caps, Sam Snyder. Those screen caps are pro. I know there's a lot of what Oh, my God. 
Change the name. Change the name. Change the mascot. 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 Change the name. Change the mascot